Welcome back everybody, Twitch367 here, and today we're going to continue with episode number 3 of our Divine Journey Let's Play. So, first thing I want to do is go ahead and get some of this iron uh, smelting in the furnace. Say so I did just wait for it to be daytime too, so that's, that's good. Um, a little bit of lag. Oh, that's not good. Should be running a little bit better. That's a spider. Okay. So I want to come out here and grab some of this food. Like so. And I also mm -hmm. want to grab some wood. There we go. And I think those are the bad pumpkins too, so I don't want to get too close to those. There we go. Come on, there we go. Just want the experience. I don't think it really dropped anything. Uh oh, come on. Let's go ahead and eat some raspberries. There we go. So for today's episode, I did kind of want to get more of this going kind of at least finish up the house maybe uh, we might not get that lucky so let's go ahead monster jerky is good to have we'll eat that instead of the berries the berries will just kind of be our backup um, for now Um, all right. So first thing I want to do, take this iron. We're going to make iron pickaxe. Perfect. Okay, and now I got a couple quests to turn in. Copper or tin? I got tin. I don't have any copper, so I'll take the copper. Perfect. Um, let's go ahead and make another chest. Why'd that not work? Oh, it's because I was doing the oak one. My bad. Okay. So there's another chest. So for that chest, we'll put all of these plant and food items. Eggs go in there too. I think that might be it. This way it's going to be easier to find any food if I need to. Stuff like that. And, well, it kind of keeps things organized a little bit. I did just do some of this up. Might need some more wood. Let's go grab that. I want to get the Tinker's Tables at least set up today. Um, I feel like that's a, a good goal. Careful not to hit the crabs because that would suck. Can't tell you how many times I've accidentally hit a crab. 
So me and my friend were actually playing this together somewhat recently. And he had a crab. And well, let's just say the crab didn't really care who was who and almost killed me. Come on. There we go. Ooh. So I don't really care about shears. Actually, I should have. Um, I do got enough of this. I just gotta find where that other sheep is at. Um, shows that it's about right here. Is it up? Are you on top of a tree? Unless it's in some kind of cave. There you are. You are on top of a tree. And I still only got one. Okay. Um, it does show that there's a couple more sheep over in this direction. There we go. Now we have enough. I just wanted to get a bed so that we no longer have to just kind of sit there at night. Switch that out. There should be plenty of wood for now. Put one right there. And harvest these berries real quick. Let's say today's episode we're gonna be kind of working in here quite a bit. Um, these go up in there too. Actually, those need to stay. Need some of those. I guess the first thing we'll do is go ahead and make a bed. Boom. Um, I craft basic stone tools already. Did that. Oh, and I actually have an iron one, so we can actually grab that finally. I keep putting that stuff in there. Um, that's where those are gonna go. I guess the bed can just go here for now. And I'm hungry, we'll grab chicken. And we'll do up some of these pork chops real quick. And now what we'll start doing, I think this is the recipe, yep, Those patterns, yes, so that got me more patterns. So we'll start with the stencil table, oh it does have to be the oak variant, okay. Nice, nice. Um, next we'll just make the part builder. So I'll switch it to the oak one. It's not what I wanted to do. Um, and then we need one of these. And last but not least, we need one of these, and then perfect. That right there got me more patterns. We can make pretty much any tool now. Well, besides like some of the better tools that you need the um, tools
tool forge for. But we still got all of that set up. Um, the tool forge will come when I have more iron, I guess. And well, I need to kind of do this. I also need about ten pieces of glass. We're just gonna do up a full stack of it. All right. Um, got some bone meal in here. Oh, it's one times. Okay, I guess it was only one times. Well, oh well. What we'll do is just do it anyway. It'll look pretty cool. 171. Yeah, it's just the exact same thing, just a different handle. Okay, that's fine. Um, I don't even. Can you? No, you can't with this version. Okay. Got glass going. I don't have any more torches on me. So that can go in there. Just kind of dump a lot of that. We'll just go ahead and make half a stack of torches. And then we'll just continue down. So I know I've already been down here. But now I can actually grab some of this extra stuff. Um, so once I get a diamond, I can throw it onto my pickaxe if that's what I end up choosing to do okay now these are gonna be pretty good to have mm -hmm. if I get them set up mm -hmm. so I always usually grab them but I never set them up Now this way could be dangerous. Yeah, that's right. I got this little bit torched up a little bit. See, there's lava there, so that way is safe from things coming at me. Hopefully. And then down here, here is a zombie. There he is. Perfect. I don't really know what this is used for too much. Um, I've never gotten that far into this pack yet. We'll take that silver and lead though. So I don't feel like exploring too much of this cave. I just want to get it safe so I can grab some of this basic stuff. Um, later on I can always come back in here and get the rest of it. I think I'm gonna need some cobblestone. Get 
going to need more coal, too. But we'll get there when we get there. Let's see. I just can't wait until my pickaxe can just mine better stuff. And then I won't have to worry too much like, oh, it can only do this. I need to have a better pickaxe. That's why I just need one diamond. Um, eventually, I'll probably end up making a different set of tools when I'm further in. But right now, this flint pickaxe will do pretty good. Alright, let's grab that coal. some more quite a bit of experience not bad oh got a little bit of lag hopefully nothing sneaks up behind me there we go and say if it was gonna go a little bit longer I was just gonna go ahead and cut the video but I need to grab as many of these as possible when I see them too I think I heard something so I'm gonna try to get out of here I think it was this way some water ones and that broke did I go too far did I go the wrong way no it's right here I think what I'm gonna do just waste the rest of that iron pickaxe boom grab these bacon jerky always nice to have throw that one on there oh I got some rotten flesh we'll just go ahead and turn that too um, those go in there. I think that's about it. The rest. Just go ahead and go into here. Perfect. And it's nighttime, so we can finally sleep. Glass is going good. Let's grab that. Ooh, that got me two wool. I can make another bed. Forgot that I made all those extra buttons for no reason. Break that. Eventually, I'll probably next episode we'll work on some more tools. I just mainly want my house to be worked on. Perfect. Okay. Because what I'm thinking is we'll finish up the house probably next episode. Um, I think the main thing I just need to do is just a bunch of mining. But that's not too bad. And then we can finally move in. Mm -hmm. I would like to probably start getting into this Tinker's Construct smeltery. And I still have to go mining more because that takes redstone.
for the controller. So hopefully within the next few episodes we can get that going. I have no idea what I have planned for the every 10th episode of this series. Because um, I know Skyrim, I kind of take breaks from the main quest and stuff. Um, I might do the same with this. Just kind of take a break from the quest book. Maybe kind of work on certain things or something like that. So I know I need to get more gravel and more clay because I don't have any clay. Dude, this is episode three. We should have a smeltery set up by that episode anyway. Maybe we'll work on like getting some armor and some like tools going. Um, we'll kind of see. We'll wait for it to be that time and well, we'll go from there. Uh, I also need torches. Just take that. Perfect. Yeah, we'll definitely work on storage soon too because well two chests is just not enough uh, let's go ahead and make another couple axes so I got the cobblestone for now I would like to get um, it set up so that I don't have to ever really worry about cobblestone and I'll have that set up because I want to set up two smelteries because um, one's going to be used to automate seared bricks. And yeah, we'll go from there. Okay. So. Just getting it all planned out in my head. I'll probably make a list of things that I want to do. I already have like a list uh, started. But I want to get a better list and add more stuff to it. Because, well, I got two quest books. Couldn't figure out why the leaves weren't decaying. What happened here? Let's cut that down. Always replant your trees just so that they can passively grow as you're doing stuff and then you don't have to be like oh I just cleared all this area and I didn't grab a tree or put my saplings back that's a whale and some sharks that's not good um, oh I meant to hit that button want to get torches placed in certain spots right in the middle perfect mm -hmm. um, we'll just use this up one more just because up here I like to do a little bit of that. We can do it here. Just to kind of torch up a little bit. Um, I guess I can throw those there too. I know it's a lot of torches and it's way too many. Or it's not really necessary. Um, but I think it'll look pretty good. Next, we want to go ahead and continue this part. 
Okay, there's sharks over there. I don't really want to mess with them. I don't know if they're aggressive by default or if like they're something that I kind of got to aggro myself. That shark's dying. Good. I mean, they are kind of my mascot, but whatever. Well, the one got back into the water. I want to see if it drops anything. That's not what I wanted to happen. The one shark die? Yes. Let's see what we can do with these. Okay. Hmm. I don't know how to get those. But hey, we got some shark fins. That's kind of cool. Oh, and it is getting close to being time to end the video for today. But before we do that, let's go ahead and grab some more. Place that there. A lot of crabs over here. Yeah, they were definitely bad pumpkins because they're uh, despawned now. Pig, if you make me accidentally kill the crab while it's killing you, or at least hit the crab, because there's no way I'm killing that crab, it'll probably like two shot me. Like most of everything in this um, mod pack. I just want to hurry up and get enough wood to finish like the frame at least, maybe. So do that and that. There we go. Um, so that kind of gets annoying just being there, so I'll get rid of that. Are you going to die too? Nope, we went back to there. I don't know if whales drop anything. Turn that into a stack of that. This way we can at least get it safe ish. Well, there's no door yet, but this way, when I make the door, um, do I have a door? It's becoming nighttime too. And it's getting really close to the end of the episode. Are you coming after me? Can't tell. I'm waiting for him to die. And that's more shark fins. 
these. So I have enough for either of these. If I did make one, I would want it to be this one. I just don't know how to get these aquatic pellets. So it'll be something I'll have to either learn from you guys or look it up when I get to that point. But with that, I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. I say I know nothing really happened too much. We started working on the house a little bit. We got the tinker's table set up. And well, we made our pickaxe. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you have not already. And with that, I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the next episode. See ya.